The proposed Passport Healthcare headquarters site is a stone's throw from King Solomon Baptist Church. We had been praying and hoping and trusting that Passport would come to Louisville and put the headquarters here. But it may not happen. Passport Health cites Kentucky's Medicaid reimbursement model as their main financial issue. The nonprofit filed a complaint in Franklin County Circuit Court against the Kentucky Cabinet for Health and Family Services. A statement from the cabinet says in part, while we certainly recognize and appreciate Passport's community investment in recent years, we agree it is a prudent move to delay costs associated with the new headquarters in order to ensure Passport's payments are made. Passport was projected to bring 300 new jobs and be a catalyst for future developments in the area. We just have to scale it back. Larry Duncan works in the deli across the street from the construction site. Well, it's a dream. We have to deal with reality. And if it's just going to be a shell, it's just a shell. We have to move on, whether they build it or not. The development received more than $24 million in new market tax credits due to its role in revitalizing West Louisville. Passport CEO Mark Carter said he was, quote, greatly saddened because of the promise it holds for a vital part of our community. Yeah. Reverend Elliott That's shares that there. sentiment. To look out there and see what was started and to see it to shut down would be a disgrace to this community. Now, March 5th, Passport's appeal will be heard in a Franklin County Circuit Court. But this coming Thursday, leaders are planning to travel to Frankfurt to hold a prayer rally where they will urge Governor Bevin to work with Passport. Reporting live from West Louisville, Carrie Grace, WLKY News.